Now, in the AI arms race, it seems China not as far behind as perhaps thought. That's um, um, a little bit premature to make such a judgment. I'd say the US or the, the, the Western world has been um, concentrated on the hardware constraints imposed on Chinese AI development. Uh, but this new tech from DeepSec is demonstrating um, alternative ways um, are possible. So in this case, they're using a software-driven algorithm of, of, of uh, maximization and um, uh, open source collaboration. So um, all these new methods have demonstrated other uh, the Chinese so-called Chinese innovation approach actually is possible to compete with the U.S. Um, uh, leadership in AI. Yeah, well, DeepSeek reportedly took 60 days to build and at a cost of $6 million. So how does that compare to OpenAI's uh, O1 model and how did they do it? Um, well, this is a still a mystery, um, to be honest. Um, I mean, the, uh, um, obviously using open source uh, method and the uh, using this so-called um, uh, mixture of expertise um, method to to, to concentrate on software um, algorithm uh, optimization. So uh, a lot of people concentrated on that, but the core team are Chinese educated um, uh, um, university, high, uh, top university graduates. So the average age is very, very young. I mean, even the management team is around 35 years old. And they sort of, to be honest, the, 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 the culture and the, their method is more like a Silicon Valley um, startup rather than a typical Chinese startup. So that's quite surprising. Uh, but nevertheless, they demonstrate these results. Um, two months and a, a budget of 2% of open AI. I mean, this is just, uh, you know, uh, everybody's talking about this. But how they did this, nobody really knows. Mm. Well, it does have Wall Street rattled. Is that justified? Um, it is because, uh, as I said, the U.S. has been concentrated on the uh, hardware constraints um, imposed on this company. But this company demonstrated a different approach. And, you know, they, they demonstrated that while using the constraint, um, GPU computing, computational power, and they still can achieve um, results on, on par or even better than the um, than the leading uh, U.S. Uh, AI models. So this means, well, really, do we really need that many a, a GPUs produced by NVIDIA or um, um, a power companies to to power the AI um, big models? So this all obviously has very strong impact uh, on the on the suppliers uh, okay. of AI hardware. So has the chip bubble been popped? Um, I don't think so. In the long run, it won't be easily. Mm -hmm. I mean, you know, um, it, the market will make adjustment. But in uh, in reality, uh, where uh, the most AI models are raised, uh, are based on, on text. So as we can see what, as you demonstrated, leading to this story, I mean, uh, uh, it, it's very much text-based analysis. But in the future, uh, as DeepSeek is 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 um, concentrating on developing AGI, that's artificial general intelligence, and the more, um, for example, picture-based, video-based analysis um, will be needed. So that still rely on heavy uh, investment in uh, in hardware. DeepSeek is open source. What does that mean in practice? That means the 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 the, the company actually published its. Um, its algorithms published its paper um, openly. That means everybody can have access to. Uh, so on the, uh, the on the other hand, by opening by by publishing this um, um, their their algorithms means um, similar similar uh, uh, I mean expertise all over the world can can participate in writing codes for them. Well, AI safety advocates have previously called for those models to never be published. Uh, how much of these discussions are now redundant? Um, 
again, I mean, the the the, the impact is still too early to judge. Mm -hmm. As I said, well, I mean, um, it is is still very early age for. Uh, for the market, for the industry, for academia to make a uh, sound judgment. Um, so, uh, so the reality is uh, this: this dipstick is is perhaps representing a new wave of um, startups in uh, entrepreneurial uh, um, entrepreneurial startups in China. So, younger generation they focusing on um, fundamental research, basic research, and the 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 the, the um, don't mind. Um, open use using or using open source approach, um, so that that demonstrates a totally different approach from Chinese traditional entrepreneurship. They're more similar to to Silicon Valley um, entrepreneurs, to be honest.